Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. So we're going to talk a little bit about Christine Brown and her relationship with Cody Brown. Some trailers have come out, some clips have came out for the upcoming season of Sister Wives. We know it will premiere on November 21st. Um, and even though the episodes have not started airing, it has yet to premiere. Viewers already know what's to come. We know that Cody and his spiritual wife, spiritual wife, Christine Brown, have recently split. And it has been confirmed that this split was documented for the show and it will be a storyline for the show. So, Christine and everything that led up to her making the decision to get a spiritual divorce from Cody, all of that has been documented for the show. I couldn't even imagine, you guys. They've been together for like 20 plus years. And while they were not legally married, like in her mind, she was in a marriage. You know, that's how she felt. She had children with this man. And she's going through this difficult time of feeling um, like she's been in a relationship with no one, you know, feeling estranged from her husband. And it's got to be documented for the show. I don't know if I could do that, you guys. I, honestly, I think it may traumatize them a little bit. It would make me feel like people care more about the show and the money from the show than my feelings, my mental health, my well-being. And at this point, I think that's probably the case. Like, I think Cody cares more about the show. I think Cody cares more... Um, about filming what's going to be good for the show. Like, oh, Christine's having a breakdown over our marriage. Great, film that. That'll be great. In a sneak peek of Sunday's season premiere, fans are giving a look at just how bad things were between Cody and Christine um, right before they decided to split. In a clip posted by People, the family is once again seen out at Coyote Pass trying to figure out what the next steps are and what they're going to do as far as building on the property. Now, Christine, she seems to still be pushing back on these plans. She still wants to move out of Flagstaff and back to Utah. And she expressed that in this scene. Uh, everybody's talking about, you know, pr what property's going to be theirs, where their house would like to be built and all of this. And she's just talking about not wanting to build at all and wanting to go back to Utah. Now, Cody and the other sister wives, they showed no interest in doing so. They showed no interest in moving back to Utah. In a confessional, Robin tells the cameras Christine is upset. It's scary. It's been absolutely scary what our family culture is looking like because we are not spending time together. You know, I, I just don't know if Cody even wants to spend time with the other wives, though. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm placing some of the blame on Cody, right? I'm placing all the blame on Cody. Like, it's up to him. He's the one that's supposed to manage this. So, why has he not been managing it? Because... I feel like a lot of other people feel he likes to be with Robin and only Robin. Now, while out at the property, Christine gets upset. Um, Janelle, she acknowledges Christine's feelings. Um, Cody, his focus is really on figuring out a way that the family will build their homes on Coyote Pass. He makes it clear that he's not worried about Christine and her feelings or the fact that she's not wanting to move on Coyote Pass. He doesn't care about that. He's not concerned about her wants. He's just concerned with trying to figure out how the family will start the process of building their homes on the property. He tells the cameras, we have to get all the property boundaries figured out though. That we have to do because we have to be able to move on that. We don't want to wait any longer. He may not want to wait any longer, but Christine definitely does. Christine, she says that she was hurt by the whole situation. She said, the whole thing is hard. It's not just about moving back to Utah. It's not just about that. I'm not going to make any drastic decisions on what I'm going to do next today. I am hurt. Christina later tells the cameras that she really needed Cody's support, that she really needed him to be there for her. But the two of them are basically estranged at this point. She said, marriage is hard, but I never wanted the kind of marriage that I have now. I never wanted to be so estranged and have extremely limited physical contact, not even holding hands. 20 years in the marriage, you guys, and while he holds hands with Robin, you know, he'll hold her hand. You know, they're walking around, he's holding Robin's hand, not Christine's, not Janelle's, not Mary's. So that's part of the reason why these girls feel like they come second, third, fourth fiddle to Robin. They need that physical connection, the emotional connection that they're not getting. 
She said, it's sad. My marriage to Cody is sad. So we're going to get to see this all play out on the show. And what we know now is that she did make the decision to move back to Utah and um, divorce Cody. I call it a spiritual divorce because legally they were never married. They were spiritually married. So I just call it a spiritual divorce. So she made the decision to leave. She took her daughter back to Utah and she is living her best life. In a cameo, she says she never knew that life could be so simple and that she is so happy and she's happy with the decision that she made. But she does want to co-parent, you know, civilly with with Cody. There's no like hatred, animosity towards him. That's what she says publicly, but I feel like bottled up somewhere in there. Like, girl, 20 plus years of your life you spent with this man who just, you know, pushed you to the side for the new one to come along. Uh, I think there's probably some trauma. I And I'm just guessing. I'm not a counselor. I don't know. But if I was in that position, I think I would have some trauma. Maybe speaking to a counselor would be good for her. But it does seem like she's doing great. I wish her the absolute best. I hope she lives it up having, you know, in the single life. I hope she dates, you know, lets men take her out on dates, out to dinner, um, you know, to carnivals and festivals. And just gets the idea of what it feels like to have a man really treat you right uh and have fun you know while you do it because i wonder how long it's been since she's really had fun with cody you guys leave me your thoughts in the comment section below season 16 of sister wives premieres sunday november 21st on tlc i will be watching um i don't know if i'll do a recap after every show because a lot of times i don't get to watch it the the evening that it airs sometimes it can be a day two three days um, but if anything interesting happens on the show, I will try to make sure I do a recap to talk about it. You guys leave me your thoughts in the comment section below. Make sure you give the video a huge thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye everyone.